Hey guys, welcome to Wrestling Days, and I am freaking out. Um, there is there is a video on WWE YouTube, and without even opening it and watching it, which we are totally going to do in a second together, um, the title is Triple H announces the WWE United Kingdom Championship Tournament. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this means. I know what all those words mean individually, but put into that sentence, I don't know what that means. Um, <laughs> I don't know what that means. I'm going to press play and we're going to find out what that means, but I am freaking out. I'm going to turn this up. And joining us for this historic moment. You know, I've had a long career. Over 20 years, and one of my favorite things about being people. a WWE <laughs> superstar was being able to tour the world, seeing countries and, and meeting fans all over the globe. Yeah. And the UK has always been one of my favorite places to come. Oh, that's and nice. We like having him. You know, the rich history <laughs> of our industry or the appreciation that the fans have here for our craft, UK has always made our tours memorable here and this is always a place that is near and dear to my heart this is some of the so best tell you how proud I pandering i've ever seen be here to make this announcement and today. i'm living it one of the great things about the wwe network is our ability to further engage our fans around the world with localized content we spend the better part of a year working right here localized with brands such as progress rev pro icw and ott in ireland wow we we spent that time to identify and cultivate the best talent in both the UK and Ireland. And today, we're excited to announce that we will crown, for the first time ever, a WWE United Kingdom champion. Oh my god. We'll crown that champion live on the WWE. Is that the belt? Is that the image? Look at the image! Oh, well, they're thrilled. <laughs> Look at that, that's the pound coin. Tournament on Saturday, January 14th and Sunday, January 15th, beginning at 8 p.m. local time. The WWE United Kingdom Championship Tournament will emanate from the historic Empress Ballroom. In Blackpool. Blackpool. It will feature 16. Regal, that's a nod to Regal. From the UK and Ireland. 16. Like we've done with NXT and the Cruiserweights, Queen, yeah. our intent is in the long term to use this tournament as a launching pad for a brand new WWE weekly show produced right here in the UK. What? No! Did you? The, the WWE are going to do a show weekly from the UK. I mean, I don't... Oh, my God. I don't know what this means. So the... Do... So the... <sighs> right, so there's going to be a tournament. 16 guys. They're competing for a championship... I don't know if that image behind is part of the belt. I don't know if it's the logo for the tournament. Um, they're going to do a weekly show. That's a lot of wrestling, isn't it? You know, NXT and 205 Live, Raw, SmackDown, and now... I don't even know what this thing is called. But that's a, that's a lot of wrestling. But then maybe they don't need or want. Well, I suppose they do want, but perhaps it's just there to cater to different tastes. You know, if you're UK, you want to watch something, maybe go along and watch it live. They cater for that now, or will be. I mean, that's just it. I've, I've dreamt of days like this. I mean, we've waited. I've waited my whole life for a, a UK heavyweight champion. And, you know, we don't seem to be any closer to that. I can't see Neville getting that achievement, unfortunately. But now they've gone and given us this. You know, a, 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 UK, a United Kingdom, a UK Championship. That is huge. That is huge. I just don't want to see it 
get disrespected. I don't want to see it. And maybe this is the start. Maybe they'll be like, you know, they'll do this again next year with Australia and Japan. And, you know, they'll have all these like little hubs and then they'll have their own champions. And then maybe the best of the best meet up at WrestleMania. And, you know, it must be all part of like some kind of long term planning. And but what a time to drop this. This is insane. And I am totally going. I don't care what money I need to spend. I am going to one of those shows. I think he said Saturday, Sunday, 16th, 17th, something like that. I'm going. This is incredible. This is honestly one of the... I can't believe it. I just can't believe it.